we are going to look at the functionality of Microsoft Dynamics INAV templates for sales, purchase and general journals. So we look at documents, we create a template, we link the template to a vendor or customer, we apply the template to a document and we see how to use that in general journal lines. So first let's type standard in the search we create a new one for purchase. Let's say it relates to phone and internet. We select the GL account. Put a quantity, an amount, and we can select some dimensions. So let's say the first landline is for the administration and we have as well some mobile phones, let's say five for the sales team. And another seven for the operations. Let's add an, another one for internet access. Okay, so the standard purchase code is created. Now we're going to associate it to a particular vendor. So electronics limited, standards vendor purchase code we create the association now let's try to use it if we create a purchase invoice for that particular vendor and we go to action get standard vendor purchase code click on OK all the lines are retrieved so it's quicker to create your document we can associate a template so multiple templates for just one vendor and one template can be associated to multiple vendors as well For the sales documents, it works in the same way. So for example, you could use it to associate your customer to some preferred items. For example, let's create one template just for this customer. So we put a convention, we just indicated the same customer number. We can put a quantity or not, and we associate it to customer 10,000. Let's do the same for another customer, 20,000. We create a new one by convention, put the same customer number, and we put different, different items. And we are, we are not limited to items, we can put other types. Let's put a resource. We make the association. And if we create a sales order for customer 20,000, and we get the standard customer sales code we have directly the list of his preferred items the functionality is also available for general journal lines 
So let's create a few lines, let's say, for that relates to the payroll. So we have to do that every month. So to make it quicker for next time, we're going to save the lines we keyed. Save as standard journal. Say that's a payroll monthly run. And we don't want to save the amount as they change, maybe. And so let's post this one. And next month, if we had to do it again, it's going to be quicker just by getting the standard journal template.